So here we have a printer magnet DC motor with a shaft encoder hooked up to a DC supply and on the oscilloscope we can see the outputs of the two channels of the shaft encoder. So I turn off the power to the motor you'll see eventually the motor will stop and now you see we get no signals on either of the input channels. Now, if we turn it on we see get a signal from each of the two channels that are out of phase. So you can see the phase of the motors. If I turn up the power, you'll see the motor speeds up, which you can see because the frequency increases. You can see the phase relationship works the same way. Again, the relative phases of the two channels is the same. Now, if we turn the motor, if we reverse the polarity of the motor, now we see what happens is that the phase of the two channels has changed relative to each other. And again, the motor is rotating in the opposite direction. As we increase the power, again, we increase the speed of the motor, but again, the phase relationship between the two channels stays the same. So we can always tell which direction the motor is going by the phase relationship between the two channels. To close in on the motor, Here we can see the motor itself as we we can see the motor speed up and slow down and if we reverse the polarity we can see the motor going in the opposite direction and again, we'll see the speed changes according to the power on the motor.